Hello everyone, my name is Fabulous Fish. I'm Catatui101. And welcome back to Let's Play Piglet's Big Game. Uh, in the last episode, we found Winnie the Pooh and freed him from his sticky trap of doom. In this episode, Indeed. you're going to be seeing why this is the scariest game ever made. <sighs> Do you remember how combat works in this game? Yeah, yeah. It's really scary. <laughs> Alright, where do I go? Uh, into the house. That we just, we just opened. Oh, that way. Oh, that didn't even look... It doesn't even look like you can get in there. It, for those of you who are calling us stupid for not seeing things, we are a tiny screen. <laughs> that is horrific. Oh my god. Alright, have fun. This music is awesome, though. Oh my god. How many are there? There's just one. You gotta go around and find his face, though. Oh my god. Oh, uh, I don't like it. <gasps> oh god. So, combo works in this game. Actually, a really cool system. You just have to push the buttons that appear to make a scary face. Oh, what does BNX. it say? BX. <laughs> that is... This is the least scary face Piglet makes. He gets way more terrifying. Honestly, I think the scariest part of this game is Piglet's faces. And you gotta pick that up or else it'll respawn. Now we can get the cooks. You know, we can get all the cookies. <clears throat> this game gets scarier, don't worry. Uh, try... This thing. I don't think it's gonna be the chair. Try that. Yeah. No? no? Try, try that. Really? Try that dip. Eh. I also think this room's just kind of creepy and unsettling when there's nothing in it now. Yeah, or, oh crap, I didn't see that. Yeah, there's like... There's, nothing. There's this eerie ambient track in this game. I know there's nothing going on. It's kind of creepy. This game does like a really good job setting Why did I go after an this atmosphere. One? What? Why did I go after that one? I don't know. You <laughs> always do that too. You always go after the one that's like farthest from the group. I go after like the first one I see. That's oh. a really good reflection effect in the mirror. Oh, that's creepy looking. <laughs> well, yes, it's this game. What do you expect? <laughs> Mirrors are creepy. Uh, try the candy cane coat rack. Yeah. Candy cane dap. Candy cane dap over there. What? I did it again. <coughs> okay, well I can't even get that one. <laughs> Occasionally the cookies glitch and land on an obstacle you can't reach them on, and that's really unfair. <laughs> Katie. Ugh. That one went up. Honestly, the biggest problem with this game is just that they go back. Yeah, I wish they didn't go back. Uh, try the rack. How did his foot reach that high? I don't know. He's, he's a magic pig. I love how his ears like wiggle as he runs. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. La -la. Where's this like subspace area? <laughs> Alright, you gotta go into the doorway open by be beating the half lump. Yeah, in there. Oh, no. To the room with the terrifying record. Is anybody in here? I don't think there's anyone uh. in here yet. There's no one in here, yeah. Uh. Get the cookies in it. Oh, my God. I know, like... What is that? It's the record. They, they made this game for kids to play. <laughs> Glad I never played this as a kid. <laughs> I know, like, a lot of people in the comments are probably like, it's not that scary, but, like... Oh, it gets worse. <laughs> well, also, I feel like like this isn't actually going to give me nightmares, but at the same time, this is one of the most like creepy games I've ever played. And like I've played like real horror games. Like I love Silent Hill and stuff. And like I don't know, something out of this game is just really just like all these innocent characters, and like this setting just makes them so creepy, you know? Yeah. Oh my god. We should let's play uh, Silent Hill someday. Yeah. Yeah. Um, Shower Memories is my favorite. I never finished that. I started to play that. Yeah, you did. I never finished it. Because we, we got busy with school. Yeah, it's a shame. Yeah, you liked it, didn't you? Yeah, it was pretty scary. But, like, it was, like, well done, you know? Like, it wasn't, like, cheap scares. That game just gets me, like, a really panic state of mind. It, like... What I like is that it's not really jump scare. It's just kind of, like, like, chasing you, you know? Yeah. It's like those bad dreams you have as a kid where you're running from a monster. I don't get that yet, because, uh, yeah, try, do you try that box? Else. Do you try that box? Uh, box? Mm, try there's it. nothing in it. Uh. Let's try this pole. Hold on. Hello, pole. <laughs> try going more that way. Can't get in there yet. Did you try the coat rack? No. Let's see. Yeah, that's it. 
And the coke's come raining down. It's been so long since you played Silent Hill. If you did uh, want to finish Admirals, you should probably start over. Yeah. I don't remember how far we got there. I think we're like a quarter of the way in. We weren't that far. It's not a very long game either, so. Oh, there we thank go. God. <laughs> all right, you can get the uh, candle now from the cake. It's kind of sad that I remember all these puzzles. They're coming back to me. <clears throat> yeah, get, like, the, get the candle. And then you can go back and melt the chocolate in the other room. He just put a lit candle in his pocket. He's a really, like, badass brave pig. Have you noticed? Yep, yeah, that way. Through the uh, terrifying mushroom door that looks kind of phallic. But for some reason it doesn't <laughs> look phallic like, from this I was side. the same thing. For like, some reason for that side, it's just a square. What? Maybe there's like a hallway. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Here we go. I always thought this looks really cool when it's on the floor. Like a melty, gooey mess. Yeah. For some reason, the pattern stayed intact. <laughs> don't know how that happened. Magic. Oh, good. Rabbit, did you oh. know there was just a, an elephant in your house? Oh, hello, Rabbit. Oh, hello, Piglet. I'm afraid I haven't much time to chat. I'm very busy, you see. Standing here. I was just hoping to find some very honey. busy just standing Everyone's here in front of my pots. First, who eats all the honey in my cupboard, and now you. Anyway, I'm fresh out. Where then do you think I'm I like how in Pooh's dream, Rabbit's an asshole. <laughs> More honey? Well, there is some next to the beehive. Oh, but it's quite dangerous, Piglet. The bees won't let you near their honey unless you find I feel like in the many adventure way of the Pooh, Pooh's well aware of how irritating he is to Rabbit. Yeah. Alright, go get the... There's cookies in that pot, I'm pretty sure. I, I, remember, I remember thinking as a kid that, like, the... The part of the ground where I was standing on, I remember thinking it was like a flip flop or something on one of his feet. Did I? Oh, he's like pooping on it over there. <laughs> oh, I'm so sick. What about these? I'm uh, cutting out coughs whenever I can, but that's why we go silent for a couple seconds. <laughs> I've been getting allergy shots recently, and uh, the first thing allergy shots do is make your allergies way, way worse, and it sucks. But. Try those. <clears throat> It'll be worth it in the long run. Yeah, hopefully. Hopefully I'll be able to actually pet my cats without breaking out in the red bumpies. <laughs> and then we can have ten cats. Ten's a little much. <laughs> I've been content with, like, two, maybe three. Oh. I'm taking another cough drop. Hold on. Sorry for the uh, ASMR crinkles you're hearing. <laughs> Put it on loop. The crinkles. I will, I will. Hold, hold on. Stop, stop, stop moving. You guys like those crinkles? Oh, sorry, sorry. You guys like those crinkles. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. We should do an ASMR Let's Play. We should. <clears throat> that'd be so great. That'd be hilarious. I don't know if I'd be able to take that seriously, though. No. I'd be so tempted to, like, break out in, like, a loud scream the entire time. Oh, that'd be so mean. Yeah, that would be. <laughs> I'm an asshole, so I do something like that. Okay, instead of breaking out a loud screen, I just have a coughing fit in the middle of it. <laughs> yeah, knowing to be you. like, hello, guy. <laughs> <laughs> You'd be the worst like ASMR maker ever. Because I'm sickly. <laughs> yeah. That's mean. Oh, you got you got the um, this horror over here. What horror? This horror. Oh, no. <clears throat> okay. This is By a brave face. This totally disturbed me as a kid. And this music. <laughs> it's like this creepy piglet puppet. And it's like... Da. Ew. We should have a video of us mimicking the brave faces every time they happen. <laughs> I can't make the inside of my mouth look like that. It's well, just well, vacant in there. <laughs> it's kind of horrific. Alright, where am I going out <clears throat> here? Yeah. You had to, like, uh, get the honey now. Oh my god. From the honey pot. The honey poop. <gasps> it's a woozle. What's this, like, creepy noise he's making? This isn't even the scariest type. Come here. I love that music cue, and I love this music. 
These are actually really hard for us to see because the screen is way too small. <laughs> yeah. Again, we're using a 6-inch screen right now. For comparison, like, half of you probably have 4-inch screen phones. Like, we're using a really tiny screen. Yeah, I, does it show the shape of the buttons? <clears throat> yeah, it does show the, the All shape. Right, I'll just have to go off of that then. And it shows right the after color. I memorize this controller. <laughs> How many games have you played with this controller? Just Wind Waker? Yeah. Oh, you played Power Mario 64, didn't you? I did, and like, I've played this game before, but... You played it on PS2, though. Oh, uh, okay. Did I get them all? <clears throat> yeah, you got all those. Yeah, you played this on a uh, PS2. The reason we're recording on GameCube is for the widescreen hack, which I failed to enable this video. <laughs> well, actually, like, I enabled it, but, like, it's rendering widescreen then smushing, so I had to unsmush it. So if it looks a little blurry for the first world, that's why. In future recording sessions, I will fix that, though. Did you see that cookie just landed right on my head? You're, you're a, a tool-assisted <laughs> wizard. Oh, it's a slide puzzle. Do, do that. I'll get the cookies first, Yeah, get the though. cookies first. If I can find them. Go, uh, go south. Mm. Go south. I don't think there's anything else back here, but oh. go south. Oh, there's more over here. <clears throat> yeah, that's where we came from. Oh. Probably those gumdrop shovels. You, you came in from here. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> so anyway, that, uh, creepy brave face machine is why you need to get all the cookies. You technically don't need all the cookies, but we're just if, gonna get them all. If you want to see all of the horrors of Piglet's face, then you, you need to get all the cooks. Well, you only need, like, uh, like half the cookies in the game to get them all. Oh. Well, we're perfectionists. But you do need to get every brave face in order to beat the game. I need, I need something. Because there are certain bosses that can only be defeated by How brave faces. How do you move Hold A. Oh. It's a little Zelda puzzle here. <laughs> Go. <clears throat> it's too heavy for Piglet. No, he's a very strong pig. Eh. Eh. Yeah, put it over there for some reason. Why does this make a difference? I, this is one puzzle that doesn't make any sense to me. So you put over, like, that smushed flat beehive. All of a sudden the bee's like, what the? Well, I sense a disturbance. And <laughs> they go over here. <laughs> but then you actually can't get the honey yet. It seems like a pot to put in or something. Mm. I think. I don't know. I guess Let's we'll see. Now I can just pick it up with his hands, his and grubby so hands. Piglet was able to reach the honey. Now he could easily fill an entire honey pot. Did Rabbit give us a pot or something? No, you have to, you have no. to get it. You have to go to Rabbit get the key, but we'll do that next episode. <laughs>